Hello guys, how are you doing today? I hope that you're having a good day and if you are not having a good day, let me know who's messing up with you and I will be dealing with them. In this video, we're going to be talking about how to become a millionaire. As many of you in the comments said that making money is a very important part of your happiness, I'm gonna do it myself, so hopefully you can learn from it. So with all this said, let's play the intro now, roll it. The very first thing that you need to realize it is that there are different people with different priorities in life. There are people that they will be interested in making a million or making a lot of money. There will be people that they will really want to have the money. There are people that they try to have the money and they don't make it. And there are people who they tried and they actually got it. You need to realize which journey you are on and hopefully this video may inspire you to achieve this goal if this is what you want. You must also remember that, as I always say, there are other priorities in life. You may be financially happy and you may have quite a bit of money, but be careful guys. You also need to understand that there are other things such as your emotions, your friends, your people, the knowledge, and there are many things that will give you happiness, not just financial, okay? So don't just think about the money, think about everything as a whole. In this little clip I'm gonna play right now, <laughs> you're gonna see what has happened to me throughout the pandemic and how my life changed. So now I'm gonna play this video and hopefully it does motivate you. It's about starting here. Before the pandemic came, I was always keen to learn. I was playful and cheeky, clearly. A unique species. Then COVID-19 was a shock, and it us all a lot. I wasn't the greatest man before, but I had a lot to still go. Since we weren't able to see anyone, I stayed at home with my magic wand, gaining more and more weight. Nobody was going to see me anyway. All the things I could have achieved, waiting for the sign to make me proceed. This is now the moment. I cannot be misled. Now that we are ready to start, millionaire people achieve their wealth in different ways. Different people build different type of businesses. However, what do they all have in common? What they have in common is they share different habits. I have been reading different articles from Financial Times, The Economist, Forbes, and they all share different habits that people can do. However, if you look even deeper than that, I've been reading an article from Harvard Business Review and it was really, really, really good. Because what they said it is that to achieve big goals, you need to start by changing small habits. The habits that I will be working on are the ones that you can see on the screen here. Those are the ones that I believe will be making the more impact on myself and are the ones that have been, have been recommended. Number 10, exercise. It is well known that if you do exercise and you keep healthy yourself, it means that you will have more energy throughout the day. So I think this is one of the habits I should be starting first and I will be doing it every single day. Number nine, sleep. People say that waking up at five o'clock in the morning is something very productive and if you do it, you will become really productive and really good. I disagree with it because I think that if you go to bed later and you wake up later, you still are working the same amount of hours. However, I'm happy to give it a try and see if it's gonna work for me or if it's not. Number eight, great. As a business owner, you need to understand what your competitors are doing, what the business are doing. And I think that reading for half an hour every day, it can benefit me a lot in my business. In addition, this time can also be used to learn different skills that will be helpful for my business in the future. Number seven, manage money. There are many different ways that you can manage your money. The way I chose myself to do it from now on, it's going to be by using an app that is called Pocket Guard. This app is supposed to be the best one to help people with investments, which is what I want to do for the future. So, there are many other ones that Forbes have recommend. I will leave them here for you once again. Number six, actively create and promote time for relaxing. What do I mean by this? Okay. Have you ever heard the sentence called work hard, party harder? Okay. I don't really mean that you need to go out every weekend because by going out, you drink alcohol if you do and when you drink alcohol then after the next day when you are hungover, you cannot really work that much. I mean, or maybe people like me that they are much older. 
But what I really mean it is that you need to make time to be with the people that you want to be with, to do some hobbies, some hobbies, some activities that you like, to be with your partner, with your girlfriend, with your mother, with your father, with your brother, with your friends. Okay? As well as this, you also need to realize that you need to be with people that they actually make you feel better. By this, I don't mean people that they tell you yes to everything, because you need people that give you some criticism as well. It's very hard to find people that they can actually tell you that something is not good without trying to hurt you. And those are the people that once you find them, you need to be with them, because they will give you feedback and they will give you good comments, then they will help you improve and become better. Number five, set big goals. In this channel, the big goal that I would like to set, it is that I would like to have 100,000 subscribers by the end of next year. Not this year, the year after. However, in your case, it could be something completely different. I believe in something called, it's, it's a book called The Secret. It's also a movie and I've seen it a long time ago. And I think that with The Secret, I'm gonna put myself everywhere, I'm gonna achieve that, I'm gonna remind you every time that I would like to have 200,000 subscribers and let's see if it's gonna work by the end of, ne by the end of next year. Sorry, 100,000 subscribers. Number four, focus on the highest value task. There is something I have been working before when I was at work, but I haven't been using it for myself and I'm so shocked. Why? Okay, something that works really, really, really well if you do this every single day. Okay. You need to have one list that you do every day with all the activities that you need to do on that day and then you need to prioritize them with different systems like before lunch, as soon as possible or by the end of the day. Then you need to have a weekly task with what you need to do on that week and you need to do as well what you would like to do throughout the year. So you need to have three calendars, okay? As I said, the ones that you're using for the year, the ones that you use weekly and the ones that you use daily. By combining them three, you will make sure that you are doing things that you have done last year, you will plan yourself, you will organize yourself, and everything will be according to plan. Number three, constantly building powerful networks. The first thing I would like to do, it is I would like to build a network just for ourselves. Yes. Okay, so I have created a Discord channel where we can all talk about the different things that are happening through our life, through our finance, emotions, and so on, okay? Please. I'll put it in the links, just click on it and you will be part of our community. Number two, create successful routines. Rich people, millionaire people, even billionaires, what they have, they have a person which is telling them what they have to do throughout the day. Myself, I haven't achieved that much of money yet. However, what I will do it is I will create myself a schedule of what I want to do throughout the day and I will try to achieve it. This schedule, you can find it on the description down below. So if you would like to know if it works for you or not, please just use it as much as you want to and write down in the comments if it's working for you or not. And final point, number one, always seeking to fail. Millionaire people, what they do, it is they are always pushing themselves to see if a project is working or not. This is exactly what I've done myself. I quit my job and I'm trying to work with the videos as much as I can. So I think I've done it already. This video is the first video of a series that I'm doing right now about how to become a millionaire. I'm not sure what's going to happen in the future. I mean, God knows. I could be here right now and nobody's going to see this video. Or I could be here right now in 20 years time and people are going to talk in about this video that I'm doing right now. You have people like Jess Bezos from Amazon or Elon Musk from Tesla. Then they started as well at the very bottom. I think that between you guys and I, if we want to, we can achieve something good and we can achieve something great. I hope that you have liked the video and see you next time. Ciao, ciao.